was a really long hike. That was a long hike. <laughs> First vlog of 2018. Happy New Year, everyone! Hope everyone had a good Christmas. We certainly did. Lots of eating and drinking. Yes, we ate and drank a lot. <laughs> so January is the time to diet for my our wedding approaching your wedding in March. Am I invited to this? I can't believe how soon it's coming around. It's ridiculous. We are heading to uh, Oaxaca this evening, uh, which is a Mexican chain restaurant in London. Not sure if they're anywhere else in the UK, but I know there's quite a few in London. We like Oaxaca food, don't we? Yeah, Oaxaca's good. It's like uh, Mexican street food. And this place is their test kitchen. So it's where they test out the new uh, recipe ideas. So it should be good, a bit different. Yeah. Oaxaca owner is the Master Chef 2005 winner. So yeah, should be good. Let's do this. I took ages to decide and then I decided to have sea bream and they've just said that it's out. So they've run out. It's annoying. But I'm gonna go for the grilled chicken breast now. So we're sharing a star for this evening and being on the lean side. Uh, so we're gonna have um, cured salmon, which would be nice. And then also a side of tender stem broccoli which is, um, well, everything we've ordered today is new on the menu, so none of it's on their normal menu. Um, so it's quite, it's quite exciting, and I'm hungry. I'm going for a steak, which I think is different to the normal steak they do, but we'll see. I think it's got different sides at least, so yeah, looking forward to it because I'm hungry as well. Yeah, that can be picked off though. <laughs> the chicken's here! The reason for the jacket is I'm a little bit nippy. A little bit of breeze bit going cold. around. And I have got just bare arms, so I was a bit silly. I do feel the cold, you see. Anyway, I need to eat. Hurry up, quick! Just had our food and it was so good. Honestly, I'm so full up. The chicken was delicious. It was um, really succulent. But where, where they'd grilled it, it was like really kind of, I don't want to say crispy, but crispy <laughs> on the outside. But it gave it really lots of flavour. The kind of parsley stuff on top was really nice. The rice was good. Uh, the, col the slaw was lovely. It didn't look huge, portion, but it really filled me up. It was delicious. And then we shared the broccoli, which was lovely. It had kind of a bit of an Asian-y kind of twist to it. It's like, I don't know, soy with, with the sesame seeds as well. It's really good. The test kitchen is more like a restaurant than a chain restaurant, more of like an independent -y restaurant. It's got a good vibe, um, like the decor, it's quite cool. And unlike their other uh, Oaxacas in town, uh, they ask when you want the food rather than just bring it out when it's ready, so that's quite nice. So just taking a little cheeky peek at the dessert, which look really good. Really, all of them. There's a dark chocolate and pecan brownie, which I, if I was to have something, I'd either have that or the vanilla and salted caramel ice cream Mexican brun brunello. Oh, yeah. I don't know what that is, but it sounds good. Anything salted caramel, you got me. A bit different. We've got our bill on a phone, going paperless, which is quite good for the environment. Well done, Oaxaca. Quite a good idea. Oh look, and you can you can rate them. This is good. How likely would you recommend this restaurant? Should we say five? I'd, I'd recommend you this give restaurant. Him, give him a five. Do you reckon? Five. Sod it. Were the food and drinks explained to you as they arrived? Yeah. Well, well. Yeah. Chick we just said chicken and steak. <laughs> so yeah, okay. let's give them a yes. 
You can also review the dishes, she's cool. Taste, yes. Portion, yes. Value, yes. 